In a previous video, we covered the path from a web browser up to the templates. So the previous path that we discussed is from the user's perspective or the viewer's perspective, the, the person with the web browser, the mobile phone. They type in a URL, uh, Django, the URL goes to the Django server. The Django server uses the URLs.py file and it sends the uh, the, the signal to views.py. Then views.py, it either sends it directly to a template or we, we, we set up a, a models.py file and then that goes to the templates. So this is the, the path if it's from a web browser. But because we're doing the server development now, there's a much more common concept, models view templates. You might also hear this referred to as MVT. MVT is a bit different than MVC, which you may have also heard of, model view controller. The model in Django is probably more accurate to be described as models views templates. The models is the data. That's what connects to the SQL server. So let's just show it in the code. Models views templates, right? So let's go to the code. There's a models.py file. Th this model has the database model. The database model consists of an image, image field, a character field for the title, and a summary. So this one's using a slightly different model, but just to give you an example, there's an image, which is the image here. We're going to extract it from the database. So the image is stored as a variable image. Then there's a title here that's stored as a character field. And then there's some type of summary here, which is this character field here. This is the model. Okay. The other component is the views. So models connect to views. So just to give you refresh the structure, the models and the views file are both in the application directory. There's a Django project, right, which is which is called gallery, and then there's an app called theta underscore image. And in there is a models and a views file. So the views, we just connected it to the model. We imported the model into the views file, and this is the connection point. The model is a class. So once we have, once we connect the views to the models, we can use the models. And this connection point is a, it's a big concept in Django. We're, we need to connect the models and the views, and this is how the, this is the connection point right here. You connect, you import the models, and you get the class, and now you can access the entire model from within the views.py file. Then the views.py file it sends it to the template, so it takes it takes the class, the model class, and it sends it to the templates file which is an HTML file. It's right here. The HTML file is in a templates directory that we created. And it's HTML and there is some specific syntax to Django. So we're gonna go forward and leverage this model, this this concept models views templates and we're going to insert some python code into the template 
to process all the data within the, the database. We can extract all the images, all the titles. And that's the real power of Jangle. So this concept of models, views, template, you need to understand it. This is the main point of, of Jangle. So let's dive in and get those images up onto the homepage in the next video.